All right, how you doing out there? Welcome to Tom McManus Webcast. It is the last day of February, February 28th, 2013. Hope you're doing well out there. Hope you're off to a good year and, and life is treating you well. Uh, a lot to get into today in a brief time. Going to make it short but sweet and uh, hopefully entertaining for you. Just got done working out. You know, one, once in a while you need those, those, those meathead just lifting weights, moving the whole time, stretching the whole time kind of workouts and Definitely got one of those. Finish with the wheel. You know, the wheel routine. My father used to be able to do that like 20, 25 times. Now, granted, his stomach stuck out a little bit, so he'd hit the ground a lot quicker than mine. But, man, a great way to finish your workout. Get the workouts in. They're good for you. I tell you, suck it up and work it out. They go hand in hand. Uh, we know this without question. Uh, had a great time up in, in uh Memphis, Tennessee. What a school at Presbyterian Day School, a private all-boy K-6 through uh, grammar school, uh, five full-time PE teachers, and they, they take PE every single day. When I got home, I asked my daughters if they take PE. The third grader does. The sixth grader only takes it once a week and never has recess, never goes outside, never running around. Remember back in, that's all we did. We, you'd eat lunch, you'd go outside, you'd play ball, you'd run around, you'd chase the girls, whatever the case may be. I tell you, not really uh, happy about hearing that at, at our school. I know that happens a lot, and I know a lot of it has to do with budgets, which which totally sucks. We've got to do something about that, private and public you know, if it's a public school, man, I hope you have PE every day. Kids should be running around every single day without question. And uh, I don't know. I, I hope that can change. And, and maybe by coming to this website, you can go out and voice your opinion as well here at SuckItUpUSA.com. Uh, sports real quick. Uh, the combine's over. Now on to the draft. Free agency first, then the draft. Good luck to your team out there. Hope they, they upgrade. Uh, news in golf. You know, I'm glad Tiger spoke out. I'm glad some other guys spoke out about those belly putters. I don't like them. It makes it easier. The, at, at the end of the day, that's what it does. Yeah, wouldn't it be nice to be able to ground your putter so you can keep it in a in a straight line a little bit easier? No kidding. Of course, who wouldn't want that? Look, I don't know if it's cheating because they, they've allowed it in the PGA Tour, but I do think it's weak, and I do think it gives you an advantage. So get rid of the belly putters. Go back to the old style. Part of the deal with putting is being able to keep that thing straight, keeping it under control and not letting the nerves get to you. So stop the wussification, PGA, and get rid of the belly putters. Hey, thanks for joining me here on the webcast. Going to be doing more of these short but sweet and to the point. Have a great day today. Suck it up and be great no matter what. It's up to you without question. And uh, we'll see you next time right here. Hug the ones you love. Tell me you love them because you never know what tomorrow's going to bring. We'll see you next time right here at TomMcManus.com, uh, soon to be, but right here at SuckItUpUSA.com. Have a great day, everybody.